Greetings, YouTube. It has been a couple months since we had a crystal opening commentary submission for my channel in the form of arena crystals and specifically uncollected arena crystals. But what you can see from Five Fives, a man that just like me loves great data, is a chance to see, I think it's 700 uncollected arena crystals. Now, I say to be conservative. If you have less than 5 million battle chips, I think it makes more mathematical sense to open the regular arena crystals for units, unless for some reason you'd rather have gold, and then the uncollected ones will uh, most reliably produce more gold. But since they are five times the cost, a.k.a. 10,000 battle chips per crystal instead of 2,000, once you get past or at the 5 million battle chip amount and you get to open the equivalent of the same of a million battle chips worth of uh, regular in terms of the number of crystals because you've got 5 million battleships for the same amount. Uh, then I think the drop rates become pretty consistent, but everything before that, you just have a smaller sample size. The variance is going to be a little bit more of a swing and a miss potentially. But I can't believe I'm saying this, but I like to say that for every 1 million battleships, you should expect to get 2,000 units. So in this case, if you're opening 7 million battleships, Maybe you should look to get about 14,000 units. And that was an incredible start. But you notice, all right, 675 units was great. But then he got zero for the second 100,000. And he ended up getting uh, only about, what, 400 from the next 300,000. So you're going to have batches where you get a crazy amount of units. But you're also going to have quite a few batches that you get almost nothing. You get like 75 units like he's been doing. Or you'll get zero. And so that's why it's just... Such a crazy difference in the unit drops for the uncollected. And I've seen people do way better on the uncollected, but I've also seen people do way worse. I mean, nothing's worse than being told, Prof, I want to quit the game. I just opened 500,000 battleships worth of uncollected uh, arena crystals and got zero units, which cannot, I just refuse to believe it, it cannot happen if you open 500,000 battleships worth of the regular. You just have too many crystals to open to not ever get any units but that can happen with the uncollected. Now, he's certainly in the swing of things now, over 3,000 units, 3,400 units. And I'll be curious to see if he gets a five-star Punisher from this, too. You would hope he'd get at least one, but as always, I have not watched to see. All right, up to 4,000 units. And check out his unit stash overall. I don't know what percent these come from Arena and what percent were purchased, but he's at 26,000 units already. Just imagine what you could do with 26,000 units, although... Several people have told me if they had even the units I have right now, which I've been holding on to about 20,000, they would just be so tempted to blow them all on featured calves, which I get how much fun that would be, but I would rather save them for ranking up materials or clearing content with uh, the champions that I've already been blessed enough to open. Uh, okay, 5,900. He is not yet halfway to the goal we have set for him based on the data of 14,000 units, but he is... Uh, still not even halfway through the opening. You know, halfway technically is 350 crystals. So at crystal 350, the goal is for him to be at 7,000, and he's almost there. But he got zero units out of that batch of uh, 100,000 battleships. He has opened a crazy amount of gold. And so he is, yeah, he's got 40 more to get 325 now, and he is slowing down big time. Okay, he needs 175 units to be on pace of the projected goal of 14,000 units, which is a crazy goal to say out loud. Okay, he got there. It actually was 50 units over. That was such a clutch batch of 10. So he them up two different videos. So the first batch of data produced 7,050 units. And so we will see if he can get to 14,000. He's starting off real well. Uh, he got 750 units in the first two batches and now it's slowing down again you'll hit grand slams and you'll strike out on these uncollected crystals but i appreciate how many screenshots he's taking even though he has the videos for data and he is also so close to having thirty thousand units and now he got to thirty thousand units that was a great batch of units from those and he is just continuing to cruise closer to nine thousand units now hit a dry spell on that batch of 10 but got over it there 250 left or 2.5 million battle chips worth of uh, hoarding. It is always so freaking impressive to me how much hoarding patience it takes to hoard 
millions of battleships, but especially seven million. The most I've ever seen, I think, submitted to my channel was about, it was between 10 and 15 million. So he, you know, was about halfway there. So just imagine five fives would have taken twice as much hoarding for you to break the record. I don't think that would be worth it for you, although you did have a lot of units before this. All right, he's over 10,000, but he's hit a little bit of a wall, and this second batch has not been as great drop rate wise as the first batch he has also hit quite the wall with everything outside of gold uh, and four star punishers he finally got five energy refills but it took him 6.2 million battle chips about to get them so that is quite shocking too now thankfully with peak milestones energy refills aren't the problem they used to be but you'd still like to see them drop more than they do in this game so the first batch was 7,000 50 units in the second batch has just been disgustingly awful. It started out well, but he has hit so many roadblocks that now he's just trying to get to 12,000 units, which is a remarkable 2,000 units less than the pace of his first. Now, he got exactly 12,000 right now, and he's ending up with 12,150, but he was about 2,000 units short in that second batch of 3.5 million battle chips of gaining the drop rates of the first batch. So this also, I think, would have been better overall had he done the regular battle chip crystals. But, of course, you never know until you open them. He could have easily uh, opened, like, 15,000 units. And suddenly you're walking away thinking, well, I don't know why you would ever do the regular over the uncollected after watching that amount of data. So he was below average in this, but it's still pretty dang amazing when you can complain because you only have 12,000 units to add to your stash thanks to arena crystals this is also why as much of a soulless grind and i get that it is that the arena is if you can add twelve thousand units or about four hundred dollars worth of free units to your stash i don't know anybody that wishes they wouldn't have that opportunity it's just you know it's the situation like the the old nursery stories growing up where you don't want to put in the the mother hubbard work but you do want the the rewards you don't want to put in the work but you want the rewards I see that for people all the time. I hate Arena. It's so boring. I don't know why you stream it, but man, I love your units. Well, you can't have one without the other, buddy. Sorry. It just it is what it is. Thanks again to Five Fives for submitting this data. And if you would like to submit a crystal opening for the Arena and you want to know where to shoot for, I think at least 3 million battleships is the minimum I would accept, but ideally about 5 million, especially if you're doing the uncollected uh, arena crystals so we can see whether or not you can get to that 10,000 unit mark which is the goal for 5 million battle chips normally have a good day YouTube and thanks again to five fives for submitting this crystal opening to commentate